today as I promised I'm gonna be doing another video on integrating maps um, into an app with Xcode a little more advanced if you're just starting out you might wa want to watch my previous video which is pretty pretty much an introduction into using uh, the MK map kit framework um, it's basic but it helps if you're just starting off so now we're going to be getting a little more advanced with a segment and control um, and I'll explain the code along the way. So we can go into Xcode, we can go into File, we can go into New Project, View Based Application, we'll just name it Map 2. That's fun. Um, I might actually make a part, another one even more advanced, but I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe not. Now we have to import the MapKit framework so that maps will work. We have to kick, right click on the UI Kit framework and reveal it in Finder. Drag the map kit framework into under frameworks. A framework is pretty much a plugin so that that thing will work. So that's that. Now we have to go into classes and go into mapviewcontroller.h. First, we have to import um, the map kit. Map kit.h should pop right up there. Now, in between here, just one line of code, and we have to say mk map kit. Wait, sorry. MK map view and we name it map view. So basically what we said here is we're gonna be using a map um, a map view and we called it map view pretty pretty self-explanatory. Now I have to do an app property. App properties are pretty much for um, uh, memory management um, but I'm not gonna get really into that. So we have to do app property um, anatomic retain. IB outlet so that we can connect it in an interface folder. MK map view, and we called it map view. Um, semicolon. So now we have to do two IB actions, um, um, two different types actually. The first one's going to be IB action dash IB action get location, and what we're going to def be defining in the dot M is when you press this. It'll get your current location. It seems a little difficult, but it's actually real easy. Second one's a different type of IV action. It'll be um, IV action set map and ID sender. And that's all you need here. And when you prep, um, this will be this for the segment control. And you'll see. So we can save that and go into the map view controller.m. And now we're going to start the coding. So we'll do the first one for the first one for the get location. It's pretty easy. Just copy and paste that right there. Uh, instead of uh, semicolon, do open curly bracket. And now we're just going to say map view dot shows user location equals yes. And oops. Didn't want that. Just semicolon and close it off. And it's pretty self explanatory. Uh, the map view will show our location when we press this button. So now we have to do um, um, the next one, next IB action for the segment control. It's a little difficult. Um, and it's not really difficult, but I'll explain it. It's a switch statement, so we have to do that open bracket so you can just copy and paste that and we'll do um oops yeah um just press enter we'll do switch um three open bracket um three uh parentheses ui ui segment control i won't go too fast here uh star close that off so we're saying we're using a ui segment control sender Close that. Dot selected. Did say index. So, um, so there's gonna be three different um segments. Um, and we'll um define those right here. So, we'll do case for the first um case case um case zero. That'll be fine. We, yeah, case zero. Uh, colon, 
open bracket, map view dot map type um equals um mk map type standard um and that's like the standard map type uh like um just the map and not hybrid we're going to be doing three one for standard one for satellite and one for hybrid and it's pretty now we have to do break it mean pretty much means we're done with that um done saying what we wanted to say it's pretty self explanatory um uh, the map view uh, the map type and the standard map type now we have to do two more of these so we can just do case one you can just copy and paste this two more times and um so we can do case one and case two so all we have to do is just um change this to map type um satellite um map type satellite and map type hybrid and hybrid is pretty much a mix of satellite and um, standard and now we just have to close this off make sure so what we're doing here is we have segment control we're saying that up here and we're saying we have uh, three different uh, breaks in them and each one will click and it'll show up the different um, the different uh, map type. I hope I explained that well. I'm not great at explaining things. Um, so now you can build that. Just to make sure there's no errors. There's errors. Expected. Oops. Oh, forgot the little colon thing. So now we can run it. And uh, it's working. So now we have to go into um, resources, the uh, map view controller dot xb. Let that load up, and obviously we want to drag in a map view. A map view, and now we want to put in a toolbar, or you could use a round rec button, but let's just use toolbar. This one will be um, locate, and the other ones will be. Um, segment control so we actually um, so that's all you need in here now we're gonna just connect them and stuff so now when you click on this go into the attribute um, the attributes and segments we have three so you have to click on three the first one will be uh, just um, map um, map and uh, the second one will be uh, sat light. The third one will be a uh, hybrid. So you see, you can click on each one, and that's what'll happen. So that's pretty much what we have to do. You can customize this, uh, whatever. So you have to go into File Zoner, click on the connections, drag the map view to map view. Um, drag the get location to locate, um, drag set map to that, and, um, uh, value change, sorry. So you can save that and quit. We can build and run, see if this works. Hopefully. It'll load up. So see? Uh, we have our standard, it opens up with a standard map view, so we can locate, and it, it shows the default location, which is somewhere in California, I'm not in California, but uh, it does work on the um, phone. Um, so we can click on satellite, and you see you have a satellite, and we can click on hybrid, and you see you have a hybrid, and you can um, pinch and zoom, and you can customize this however you like. I hope you enjoyed. Um, thank you for watching. Um, goodbye.